the turkey has all been eaten, the chocolate boxes are empty, and we all have wonderful intentions for 2014. And you know what? This guy is going to help us. It is, of course, medicinal chef Dale Pinnock. Good morning to you, Dale. How are you doing? We're in a different surrounding this morning. Yes, absolutely. The last time you were with us, you were in the Ireland AM kitchen. So we're at the village at Lyons this morning. I know, what a beautiful setting it, it is, is as well, nice, it's amazing. It is nice, isn't it? And a slightly bigger kitchen as well. Slightly bigger, yeah. <laughs> now this series is Healthy in a Hurry. Mm -hmm. Very timely because we all have wonderful intentions yes. at the start of the year. But um, I have to be honest, Dale, normally when I think of super healthy food, I think of boring food. I know, that's my mission really. Is just You're going to change all that. Yeah, well, just to show people that healthy food is really accessible. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to cost you a fortune. It can taste amazing. And you know, it doesn't involve like hours and hours of work in the kitchen. You know, Brilliant. we're all busy. I haven't got time to spend hours in the kitchen. You can eat well, you can enjoy your food, and it can be done in a hurry as well. Brilliant. You know, okay. Quick and easy. So, what are you going to do for us today? You're going to ease us in gradually, aren't ease you? Ease us in gently. I'm going to do a nice little quick breakfast. This is the perfect breakfast if you're, you're in a hurry, you want to eat something, but you haven't got time to sit down. It's something you can knock up, put in like a little container, off to work. Take it in the car it's with you or on yeah. the on the bus or wherever you're going. Yeah, it's it's a smoothie, but it's not your typical kind of fruit smoothie. It's something with a, a little bit more depth to it. It's actually Go on. A cheeky chocomolo choca mocha <laughs> chili breakfast bomb. A cheeky choca mocha chili breakfast bomb. That's my name. Chili for breakfast it. bomb. Okay, okay, basically it's it's a chocolate smoothie. Okay. Which does it get much better than that? No, I can right? start my day with a chocolate smoothie, definitely. Yeah. So you're starting with you're starting banana. Starting with a banana. You want one that's quite ripe. You want okay. one that you see like the little brown spots on the skin. Okay, really? It's going to really? blend better and it's going to be a little bit sweeter. When they're still green, they're going to be quite starchy and it's a bit like, you know, it's yeah, a funny, it's a funny bitter, texture. Aren't they? Yes. 250 mils of milk. I mean, you can use any milk. You can use soy milk, rice milk, regular milk, whatever, whatever takes your fancy, really. Okay. And this is one of the best ingredients, absolutely. This is chocolate powder, just like a good quality cocoa powder. You can use raw chocolate powder as well if you want to. Okay. Some really, really amazing benefits here. There's some, in, some interesting research been done at the University of Reading, and they've found that some of the compounds that you find in chocolate, things called flavonoids, yes. can actually temporarily lower blood pressure. Really? Yeah, they actually cause a, a relaxation of the muscular walls of our blood vessels. As those muscles relax, the vessel gets a little bit wider and the pressure within it drops. You know, it's not going to replace a medication anytime soon, but it's a perfect example of a kind of food that people can start to add to their diet if they've got a, a, that kind of concern. Wow, okay. In, in this form, Dale, or in any form? I would say as pure as you can get, really. Okay. I mean, obviously you can have a chocolate bar, but you would go for something like, a, like an 80% chocolate, you know, one of the dark chocolates. Yes, with the high percentage of cocoa Yeah, when it's all like cream and sugar, then you're kind of negating some of the benefit, really. Sure, okay. <laughs> so I've got a little bit of honey just to sweeten it. Lovely. Honey's always a great ingredient as well, isn't it? It's awesome, yeah. I mean, it's 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 a much lower lower risk sugar, if you like. I mean, there's, there's nutrients associated with it, so it's not just like empty calories. And what kind of honey do you normally buy? Just whatever, really. I mean, I, I don't think you necessarily have to go mad with any of these really expensive honeys. They're great. They've because got, some of them are really expensive. Some of them are bonkers. They have, they, some of those have got some interesting benefits when you're using them topically on wounds and stuff like that. But for something like this, you really don't need okay. to go nuts. Your bog standard honey is fine. Yeah. Now, this is an interesting little addition. Some chili powder. Yeah. I wouldn't yeah. have thought of chili Chocolate powder. Chocolate and chili. It's like a, a match made in heaven. It really is. Don't go bonkers. Look how much is there. That's like, you know, that's a third of a teaspoon. Right, okay, okay. So that so spoon's go slightly easy smaller here. than a teaspoon. You can always add more if you really, really want to, but it's, it's impossible to take it And away. what about the benefits from chilli powder? Because we're hearing a lot more yeah. about chilies, aren't There's we? There's similar benefits um, that you would associate with the chocolate as well. So it actually is what we call a vasodilator. It does widen the blood vessels a little bit. Okay. Whenever the blood vessels widen, the pressure within it drops. Nowhere near as strong as chocolate, and, and its effect is much more transient. But it does kind of warm you up a little bit okay. as well. So obviously on a cold morning, it's a really, really nice addition. Okay, on a, on a cold morning, this is perfect, isn't now, this? Now, a the shot of coffee, a shot of coffee. For some re really odd reason that I don't understand, people think that coffee is really, really bad for you. Mm. There's absolutely no evidence that coffee is bad for you, but a huge amount of evidence to show that it is incredibly good for you. Really? Yeah, for balancing blood sugar, for obviously like mental health as well. There's been some amazing studies. Go out there and have a look at some of the research. It's phenomenal. And we hear all the time that coffee is so bad for us. Yeah, it's just an urban the caffeine it's an urban Obviously, if you're sensitive to caffeine, probably not number one choice of ingredient. But if you're not, there's a lot of benefits there. Really? Obviously, you know, the difference between, as they say, the difference between a poison and a medicine is dose. 
So if you're on 20 cups by lunchtime, probably overdo it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but as a, as a so morning boost. So everything in moderation. Yeah. Eh? As a morning boost, it's awesome. It's okay. Great. So now I'm just going to whip it up. And you're getting your coffee hit here as well. Coffee and yeah. chocolate. So yeah. It doesn't get much better than that. So you just need these ingredients ready to go, Dale. Yep. What about calories? Calories, schmalories. I never really worry about calories, to <laughs> I be honest. I had an idea you were going to say that. Yeah, it's really where the calories are coming from. Okay. Yeah. Very little, actually, because really think about it. You've just got a banana in there. I mean, there's no calorific content, really, of the chocolate powder. The calories you get in a chocolate bar comes from the sugar. Mm -hmm. um, so, very, very little. Okay. That looks good. So there we go. Oh, a little bit of banana there. So That's yeah, okay. blend, you know, blend it for a little, a little longer just to get it nice and smooth. Mm -hmm. But we never have time on our side with these things. So there you go. Can I have a little taste? Have a little taste. Let me know what you think. And you should get a little chilli here. You get the coffee in there. Oh, Dale, that's so good. That's awesome, isn't it? That is gorgeous. It's great. And I, I wasn't convinced, I have to say, halfway through that I was thinking, mm, I still prefer my morning coffee. <laughs> that's really good. Yeah, but you get your morning coffee, you get that. Well, it, there's an aftertaste it, yeah. of the chilli. Yeah, it just, just gets you just, just at the last minute. But that's something you can put into a little container. That is fantastic. In the car off to work.